Hey, this is Dr. Osborne with Web Wellness University and drpeterosborne.com. And today I've got a nice image of a classic example of the fingertips in a patient who had been priorly diagnosed with a hypothyroid condition. Now, a couple of really classic things that we can see here. The first is around the cuticles. You can see the really jagged and rough edges. You see it on both sides here. This is formal name for this is called paronychia, and it's a very, very hallmark sign um, and very, very classic in patients who do have a hypothyroid condition, meaning low thyroid condition. Now, this type of symptom nutritionally is oftentimes also linked to a protein deficiency. And um, interestingly enough, one of the major forms of amino acids, amino acids are the building blocks for protein. But, but one of the amino acids responsible for helping thyroid function is called tyrosine. And so oftentimes we will see a protein deficiency and in particularly a tyrosine deficiency in patients who have low levels of thyroid and it will present in the cuticles just like this, what we call paronychia. Now, another classic example of, of uh, thyroid fingernail is this white distribution, this vertical white ridging that we see on both sides in the nail beds. Now, this is oftentimes indicative of nutritionally of a selenium deficiency, meaning a selenium deficiency can cause these types of findings. Now, why is that important in someone who has a thyroid condition? Because selenium is a mineral and it's absolutely essential in the conversion of thyroid hormone. T4, which is the inactive form of thyroid hormone, has to be converted into T3, the active form of thyroid hormone. Now, T3 is is the hormone that communicates to your DNA and speeds up your metabolism and has all those wonderful effects that we're looking for in thyroid hormone. And without selenium, you don't convert T4 to T3 very effectively, and it will look like this oftentimes in the fingernails. So look at your fingernails. If you find these types of lines, if you find these types of white spots, very well might mean you have a selenium deficiency, also might mean you have a thyroid condition. So I would advise you if these are present on your fingers to visit with your doctor and have your thyroid fully evaluated. Now, one other thing on this you can see here is the splitting at the tips of the nails. This is also, again, very, very common in patients and people that have a hypothyroid condition. So again, look at your fingernails, see if you have these types of findings. If you do, you might want to follow up with your doctor and have your thyroid evaluated. So hopefully this was helpful for you. This is Dr. Osborne with Web Wellness University. You can visit us online at drpeterosborne.com uh, for more great tips and health advice. Take care.